System contamination caused either by improper evacuation or improper repairs. This is a picture of a scroll compressor that has been subjected to non-condensables and contamination. Was this system properly evacuated at startup? Was proper installation techniques used? And was there a previous failure introducing moisture and acids into the system? Copper plating is evidence of moisture and acids in the system. This copper buildup usually builds up in bearings and after a period of time displaces the oil in the bearings. The bearings seize and you have compressor failure. As shown in this slide, as foreign debris such as copper circulates throughout the system, it gets embedded into the compressor components and any debris as it builds up over a period of time will lead to compressor inefficiency and ultimately failure. We have shown in previous videos the importance of low flow nitrogen purge throughout the system while brazing on copper lines to reduce the amount of oxidation in the system. The pictures that we have shown in this presentation also show the need to keep contaminants out of the system. So let me once again stress the importance of proper evacuation. Anytime a system is started up or anytime repairs are made, a good evacuation should be made on the system. Make sure you have a good half inch brass T, a short half inch hose, core removal tools, a good vacuum pump, and a good micron gauge to show your vacuum level. Always do a good evacuation on a system to alleviate the problems that we showed in this little video.